Well, our run on the fourth season of Young Justice continues, and we got a new episode today in Involuntary. The Martian storyline continues, and we have what may be a major change to the Young Justice universe. Let's dive into our spoiler-free review and talk a little bit about this week's episode. Now, before we dive in, though, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and ring the bell for all the updates. Also, we got this big giveaway. We have the PlayStation 5 to give away at 25,000 subscribers. All you need to do to get in on our giveaway is be a subscriber and leave us a comment. Also, make sure you check out the Buy Me A Comic link down below. It's a pretty cool way to support this channel with a tiny bit of pocket change, all by creating zero new obligation to yourself. We really appreciate it. Well, once again, we're into our fourth episode of Young Justice. And like I said, this is a spoiler-free review, but this week's episode had some major implications, and I'm going to do my best not to give any of them away. Now, this episode definitely picks up where the last one left off, and carries on the Martian marriage story we've been following pretty closely. We actually dig a little deeper into the caste system and its impact on the Martian people this episode, and, interestingly, more of the traditions that we got highlighted in the previous episode. And there was quite a bit of Martian magic this week, something that played out very visually pleasing on the screen. One thing I will say about this story is it takes some risks. You don't really see a lot of superhero media that take on things like prejudice and the caste system displayed on Mars in such a direct way. Heck, even Desat thought it was outdated in the series, so it really does highlight the message they're trying to bring, and honestly, it reminds me of some of the old X-Men that took on the issue in the same manner. To me, the biggest part of this episode was Nolan North. Superboy has seriously evolved since he made his first appearance in the series, from that angry young guy to a person with nuance and understanding of the impact of people's actions and feelings. His heroics in this episode take center stage and will definitely ripple throughout at least the rest of this season of Young Justice. We also got a little more information on the Legion of Superheroes. Now, this is spoiler-free like I said, but their mission becomes more apparent as this episode plays out, and I do have to wonder what kind of larger impact they'll have on not just this season's storyline, but previous seasons. Yeah, I'm talking about Wally. Now, I'm not gonna lie, the episode ends with a bombshell, and takes a turn I was not expecting at all. It's still unclear to me whether the ending is actually going to stick, where it was a bit of an episode cliffhanger, but if it does stick, it's probably the biggest moment in Young Justice since Season 2. From a technical perspective, the episode was another excellent entry. The animation continues to be smooth, and the Martian landscape and the magic actually all continue to look really great. The voice cast continues to be really, really good. Nolan North, Danica McKellar, and Greg Sips all nail their characters once again this week. I do think, though, that telepathy has run its course, as I mentioned in the last review, but I really think this story arc might actually conclude with this episode. We did get that poster yesterday that broke down a lot of tigers, and I do think the next episode is going to focus on her and a lot of those characters that were in that poster. If you want more information on that, check out our link down below. Now, overall, I'm going to give this episode a 7.5 out of 10. An improvement on the last one, still leaving us room to grow, but maybe being a little responsive to that very emotional ending. Hopefully you guys will like this episode too. Make sure you come back and comment, and remember, try not to spoil the big event in this episode for other people. Give them a chance to see it too. Sound off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, you're not going to get any updates. Peace.